Well, welcome. Racco here. I trust you're having a wonderful weekend, and I hope you gain some insight and value out of this video. So we have some great news that was dropped by POTUS. POTUS is also referred to as 45, but I like to call them POTUS. I want to introduce a new term that I'm going to start using in my videos, and that is Pino. President in name only. I guess you know who that is, right? Well, there was a statement released by POTUS, and it has to do with the information that was found in Pima County. And if you don't mind, I'll just read the article to you. Well, the article was based on a statement released by POTUS. So the statement reads that your favorite Republican candidate was leading Pino by 3%. Until these mail-in papers started rolling in at a very high rate. Wow, that's very interesting, isn't it? It goes on to say that in two precincts in Pima County, they had mail-in papers at 100%. And in 40 other precincts in Pima County, they had over 97% mail-in papers. So, I definitely believe that Pima County thinks that it's important to make their choosings, but these numbers are quite questionable because, well, the average in the nation is 71%. And I would argue even those numbers are questionable because a lot of us American freedom-loving patriots, well, we don't care if it's rain or snowing or whatever. We like to show up in person to make our choices, right? Anyhow, this is all great news, and who better to release this stuff than POTUS? Yeah. And another great thing that I wanted to share with you, in case you don't know, there was a recent poll that was released that, well, 56% of Americans believe that the choosing of last year was invalid. Great inaccuracies. Not safe and secure like we've been told. And there is now a movement that our Patriot Warrior Wendy Rogers has been working on and she has over 138 signatures on calling for full forensic audits. And, well, a funny business is found, decertifications or running the uh, choosing again. This is all great news. So I want to thank you for spending a couple of minutes with me. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. And until my next video, I'll talk to you later.